Question 13, calculate 3 quarters of 840. Well, we've got to be able to do this without a calculator. So, let's think about a way of doing it. So, if we start with a circle and split the circle into quarters, we could even think of this as a pizza if we want to. So, if our whole pizza is worth 840. Now, we want to find three quarters of it. Now, the first thing we need to do is find what's in each quarter. So, in other words, we need to find what one quarter of 840 is. To find a quarter of anything, you half it and then half it again. That will always work to find a quarter. So, half of 840 is 420. And half it again, well, half of 400 is 200 and half of 20 is 10. So half it is 420, half it again is 210. So one quarter equals 210. And now we can fill that in on our diagram. One quarter is 210. But we want three quarters. So we want three of these pieces. But remember, quarters are all the same size, so they're all worth 210. I could write it on this last one here, but I'm not going to because I'm only interested in three quarters. So what we're interested in now is what 210 plus 210 plus 210 is. So we could do it like this, 210, add 210, add 210. We could actually add them together. Or we could say, well, what is 210 multiplied by 3? Because we've got the same number happening three times. Either way should give us the same answer. Let's double check. 0 plus 0 plus 0 is 0. 1 plus 1 plus 1 is 3. 2 plus 2 plus 2 is 6. So it looks as though the answer is 630. What would have happened if we'd have got three lots of 210? Well, three lots of zero is zero. Three lots of one is three. And three lots of two is six. So again, we've got 630. Therefore, three quarters of 840 is 630.